All right, guys, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're going to be talking about something crazy that was just posted on Twitter today. And uh, if you guys are new to the channel, make sure you guys drop a like and subscribe. And without further ado, let's get right on into it. On Twitter, Infinity Ward went on and created this tweet. I'm going to put it on screen right now so you guys can read it. They put on new missions, new exclusion zone, and difficulty tuning. Prepare for DMZ's Season 2 update with our deep dive blog next week. Now, we're going to cover the three topics that they did say today. They're going to be adding new missions. Now, if you guys are DMZ players, I'm sure you guys have done quite a bit of your missions, if not all of them. Some people have been completing them. Um, it's just been a crazy thing. It's kind of like an objective thing to do inside of DMZ that gives it a point to do. Um, they're going to be adding new missions, which is crazy. I don't know if they're going to be adding a new whole new faction if they're just going to be adding new tiers, like say tier six for each uh, faction or whatever they're going to do. But I know for a fact that tier six, if they do a tier six, they will be extremely hard and challenging for people. Um, Cause if you guys have tried tier five missions, they're crazy, man. It's so hard to actually complete them, especially if you're a solo. I don't even think many people have completed most of them solo, but it's definitely hard and it's going to be crazy when they add this considering it's just a whole new thing inside of the game. So they also tweeted new exclusion zone. Now this is going to be also amazing as well. That means we are getting that new map, the resurgence map from DMZ and Warzone 2. So if you guys have paid attention to the community lately, you guys will know that this resurgence map was told that it'll be coming to Warzone 2.0 and we actually made a video about it. But we didn't know if it was coming to DMZ uh, for sure, but it actually is now. So that is very good. It's going to be cool because these new missions and a new map, I'm sure a lot of these missions will have to do with that new map. It's going to be a smaller map, not as big as Almazra, but it's going to be basically like um, Warzone 1 map, Resurgence, stuff like that. Not the Alcatraz, but it's going to be basically kind of somewhat that size, which is going to be very cool to see, especially if they add new guns, new stuff like that inside of the game. Hopefully they do add a few new bosses. It'll definitely make it a lot funner to play scare me about one thing they did say was they are going to be some difficulty tuning so this could be really good or it could be really bad they could basically take the game and make it a whole lot easier make the ai's easier or they could take the game and make them a whole lot harder which is definitely scary to see that they are going to do one or the other which some of the ai's they are a little powerful sometimes they're not it just matters i think on location inside the game i think there's certain locations that if you push towards the ai are a little more strong which kind of creates a good gameplay and a good game flow of the game you know you can't just go everywhere you want it's definitely an amazing thing to see inside of the game but yeah this tweet man it is absolutely crazy i hope this map actually works out and it's really good i hope the faction missions kind of revolve around that map i really hope they don't put in more factions for almazra if they do add these new factions and maybe they'll do a lot of them maybe they'll do a whole nother two three factions with more tiers i hope they just make them missions for building 21 in this new map that we don't know the name of yet um it could just be called the exclusion zone kind of like on the tweet that could have been like a little leak they have for us and gave us the name of the map and nobody knows it yet but i sure hope that these faction missions don't kind of come back to El Masra. i want El Masra to be separate from those i don't want them all to be kind of the same thing so that's really my hopes for this new update. I just kind of wanted to bring this to you guys because I know a lot of you guys like to hear the DMZ news and just might not hear it whenever it does come out. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. Hopefully you guys did enjoy it. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And I will see you guys in the next video. Uh, have a good day. Have a good night. I'll see you guys. I'm out. Peace.